everyone, Amy Love here, here to share with you what I have been creating lately. And I was inspired to alter these pegs by a video I saw by um, Deanna Marie. Hi, Deanna. And she was inspired by Jeanette. So, I mean, just crafty inspiration all around. But ever since I saw her video, I have had it on my bucket list to do. And I finally had the opportunity to do it. So I was very excited about it. So I'm going to show you one without the um, bow around it first. Look at this. How cute are these? Now, a lot of these little bits I got from Angel Dream Crafts because, you know, they're just perfect to use for these. Like these singular... Focus. You were doing so good, camera. These singular rhinestones. Um... There's two different singular rhinestones I got from Angel Dream Crafts. That's one of them. And is the other one on here? No. But I did add some rhinestone train. Uh, yes, I can speak. Some rhinestone cup chain I got from Angel Dream Crafts right there. Um, this beautiful rolled rose is also from Kim's shop. And there's one of her clay flowers right there. Isn't it? I just think it's gorgeous. It's so gorgeous. So this is before I add the bow. And then here's one that I have the goodies from Angel Dream Crafts. And bling goes really good on these too. But I also added this beautiful beaded butterfly from Karen Villager. Thank you, Karen. I'm still using them and loving them so much. And then this, um, oh, blurry. We decided to be blurry. You guys, sometimes it works and sometimes it won't. <laughs> this big old piece of bling right here, this rhinestone I got from Angel Dream Crafts too. And there's more of her clay flowers in there and more cup chain. Another one of her rolled roses. I mean, they're just, they're so stinking cute. I can't with how cute they are. And so here is another one I created using another piece of bling from Kim's shop and a bunch of her... Look at, there's that rhinestone real good. I, if you can see it, it's, I love the shine on that. The sparkle on that is gorgeous. It's more of her clay flowers. But this is what I'm basically making them for, is to gift out. I mean, what a precious way to gift out some lace. Don't you think? I think it's so sweet. Right? And there's more bling from her shop. She does have um, some flat backs that would be great for this too. And if you would like to see how to make them, because I checked Deanna's channel and I checked Jeanette's channel and I didn't see like a how to. So I know that on Angel Dream Crafts channel tomorrow, she'll be doing a live, but I'll be at work and she's going to be creating these. So if you're interested to see how to do it, be sure you follow the link to her channel below and check that out tomorrow. And then if I remember, if you've missed the live, I'll try to link the live below after, you know, after it's up so that if you want to see how to do it, you, you can. But I think they're super cute. I enjoyed making them so much, so much fun. And I just think they're pretty. They're just pretty. So I hope that you give it a try and let me know what you think. Please leave me a comment and give me a thumbs up. And I will see you guys on the next one. Oh, and don't forget below is also a link to the store where you can get some goodies to decorate some pegs like this. All right. Bye, everybody.